So now let's try and actually capture a long exposure for ourselves. The longer that we leave the shutter open, the more light that's let in, and all the things that are moving inside of the frame will be blurred out. For this long exposure, obviously we're gonna have to turn on our camera, set my aperture to f8, ISO to 100. I'm gonna change my release mode about five seconds, and then go ahead and set the shutter speed down. I mean, that looks pretty cool to me. I'm always manual focusing. We're gonna go ahead and punch in, make sure we get critical accurate focus, punch out, but we'll go ahead and use a 10 stop ND filter. So I think we're gonna need about a two minute shutter speed, two minute exposure. Go ahead and hit the shutter. Now the timer is done, we go ahead and click the shutter button again. That is a long exposure right there. Nice and gloss over water with a lot of movement in the clouds.